Hello, welcome to Phantasma Studios. What nightmare may I assist you with today? Oh, I see. All right. That does sound like it's going to be an exciting one. Sure, please take a seat. Now, is this your first time working with us? It is. Okay. No, that's very exciting. It is... It is an interesting process. Right. No, I don't need to know any of your personal details. We do understand the importance of confidentiality in these matters. Of course. But I will need to take down the information of this person you are trying to uh, share some sort of imagination with. Okay? Right. Oh, all right. Sure. No, the process is... Well, on our end, it is relatively simple once we get the information from you. We would need to know a list of this person's information, certainly. Um, their name, whereabouts they live. But you would give us the personal details, so things that they may be afraid of, things that they dislike, or, contrastingly, things that they love, things that they are very fond of, that they care very much about, so that we can tap into what it is that makes them tick, and create a personalized nightmare for them. Now, we do offer the option of a sort of one-time scare, or a series of recurring nightmares. Now, this can be the same nightmare over and over again. <clears throat> Pardon me. It can also be sort of, um, well, an anthology series of nightmares, to put it in that way. Um, you can have separate nightmares with a common theme, that way the person is sort of tortured for a long period of time every time they go to sleep. But again, depending on your needs, we could also just do one. No, no, that's all right. We upload everything directly to their consciousness, so no need for anything like that. All right, so I'm going to take some personal details then. Could I get, let me set my computer up here. Okay, could I get this person's First and last name, please. Okay. All right. And do you happen to know their date of birth? If not, that's okay. We can just take their age. Okay. <laughs> not a problem. Would it happen to be... Right, of course, of course, okay. Excellent. Now, I am going to just need to confirm the exact city that this person lives in and the country. <laughs> we just need to confirm. Sometimes people do send nightmares abroad. I assumed that was the case, but we have to check. Okay, excellent. Now we get to the interesting part. Right, we get to go through and select things that this person may be afraid of, life experiences that could cause them to be more susceptible to certain fears or uh, disturbing images. <laughs> okay. Now, I will ask, does this person have any, um, limitations? And by that I mean, are they hard of hearing? Do they have difficulty seeing? Do they need glasses? Are they legally blind? That sort of thing. Because if a person is hard of hearing or completely deaf, we certainly don't want to rely on auditory triggers. <laughs> okay, not that you're aware of. Okay, that's fine then. Um, 
so that means we have more options. Okay, so for the more base aspects of this, we just want to get a bit of a profile here. So, has this person, to your knowledge, experienced any traumatic incidents in their life? It could be anything ranging from war, um, y yeah, things like that. Not the, not the eight, okay. Okay, <laughs> perfectly fine. We just need to know. Um, all right, so now we get to the interesting parts. Does this person have any specific fears that you are aware of? It could be anything from, we'll go through some of the more basic phobias like clowns, spiders, heights. Oh, okay, okay. Let me just select from my list here. Okay, and you said the heights, okay, oh, there may be, all right. Okay, yes. Do you know if this person has any family members that they are particularly close to? And there it is. All right. Yes, we do like to add personal things like that in sometimes, depending on the level of fright that we're going for. And if you're looking for just pure fun horror, like ghosts, witches, vampires, or if you're going for something that will cause them to slowly unravel and psychologically self-destruct. Okay. You, okay, okay. Yeah. No problem there. All right. Does this person have any... Oh, okay. You would like to add... All right. No, that's very devious. Okay. It's wonderful. Okay, let me look here. There it is. Okay. You know what? I'm going to double up on that one. Just to be sure. Okay. Now, do you know how many days you would like this nightmare to be reoccurring? If you would like it to reoccur at all. And are you looking for it to be the same thing each time? Slightly. Oh, that one would be sort of the final one. Okay, okay. So for the first one, are we thinking something just to sort of unsettle them a little bit? Right. We could. We could do... Now, do you think this person is going to be more... <clears throat> More of a ghost or demon or shadow person. Okay, sure. Okay. Right. Yes, we could do that. Um, a childhood home. Do they have a specific? Perfect. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, we do like to add those sorts of things in. Do you know the town where this person grew up, just as an aside? Okay. Okay. Right, we just want to make it more personalized for them. Okay. And do you have any... <clears throat> Pardon me. Any other specific requests? Okay. And was that for the... Okay. <coughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Alright. I think we have a pretty good base setup here. 
we've chosen the specific elements of the dream, we have some background information. We'll send this off. We will have the area where the person currently lives analyzed, um, their home, and then we'll do a geographic analysis of where they grew up and sort of combine those elements. Um, are there any medical issues that you're aware of, physical or psychological? Let me just... Okay. No, it's just good to know that. Right. Right. Okay, so... We have those specific elements that you requested. We have their fears. Some... Borderline phobias, perhaps. We will combine those. We'll get a series of dreams. <laughs> dreams. Nightmares set up for this person. When they are ready, we cannot tell you exactly when these will be implemented because we have seen a sort of decrease in the level of fear because people inadvertently send up signals or alerts to the person that they have requested these nightmares for sometimes. And it kind of prepares this person that something bad might happen, so they're already a little bit on edge, or they're more hypervigilant. We like it to be a complete surprise. So we don't tell anyone. But based on the items that you chose, the history that you gave, and the impeccable research that the team does, I have a feeling you'll know. Right. Yes, absolutely. Now... Mm-hmm. Oh, of course, yes. When this is all done, uh, if you feel like you would like to continue, if they were effective, um, and you would like to continue on with it, you can let us know. If it wasn't quite enough, and you need to add a little bit of extra psychological damage, we can certainly rework things or add new items into it. Or if you have someone else in your life that become a bother to you that you would like to uh, share some imaginative dreams with. We're always here for that. Okay. Now, I know that when you made the appointment, you gave your credit card number. Right? So, there's no extra charge for anything. It is on file. If something comes up, we have the number on file that you used to call. But again, we don't like to take too much personal information. That's why we asked for only a first initial or a nickname, whichever you prefer. And I think you put as your nickname... Right, right, okay. No, that was cute. Um, so, like I said, if we run into any unexpected issues, we will contact you. But again, there's nothing to worry about on your end. Um, this person certainly has some things that they're going to have to worry about soon, but you just sit back and enjoy the ride. Okay. Right. Now, I wish you a good day, and I hope that you have good dreams. Okay. And hopefully things go well, or poorly, depending on how we're looking at the situation. Either way. We hope that it works out in your favor.